PM Modi to visit Indonesia next week to attend G20 summit. Details here. The G20 or Group of 20 is an intergovernmental forum of the world's major developed and developing economies. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will visit Indonesia from November 14 to 16 to attend the G20 summit at the invitation of President Joko Widodo, the Ministry of External Affairs announced on Thursday. On the sidelines of the summit, Modi is expected to hold bilateral meetings with some of his counterparts, the Mi said in a statement. At the closing session of the summit, Indonesian President Widodo will symbolically hand over the G20 presidency to Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi, the Mi statement read. India will formally assume the G20 presidency on December 1st. The statement added that during the summit, the G20 leaders will deliberate extensively upon key issues of global concern under the summit theme of Recover Together, Recover Stronger. According to the ME, three working sessions will be held as part of the G20 summit agenda, food and energy security, health, and digital transformation. The summit is likely to be attended by U.S. President Joe Biden, British Prime Minister Rishi Sunak, French President Emmanuel Macron and German Chancellor Olaf Scholz, among others. The G20 or Group of 20 is an intergovernmental forum of the world's major developed and developing economies. The group comprises Argentina, Australia, Brazil, Canada, China, France, Germany, India, Indonesia, Italy, Japan, the Republic of Korea, Mexico, Russia, Saudi Arabia, South Africa, Turkey, the UK, the US, and the European Union. Meanwhile, PM Modi on Tuesday unveiled India's logo, theme, and website for its presidency of the G20. The logo, created with the four colors of India's national flag, comprises Earth sitting atop a lotus. The seven petals in the logo signify the seven seas and the coming together of seven continents at G20 India 2023 and the Earth reflects India's pro-planet approach to life. It also derives the theme of G20 India 2023, Vasudheva Kutumbakam, One Earth, One Family, One Future.